All right, guys. So don't forget. Um, I'm gonna be giving away a Evo Shield hat once we hit 25 subs and we get 25 likes on this video. And don't forget to follow me on my Instagram and DM me questions because I will be doing a Q&A soon. So, yeah. Without further ado, let's get right into the video. Nothing can stop me. I'm all the way up. All right, so as you can see before in the intro, um, you're supposed to subscribe to my channel, like my chan my video, this video right now, and comment either me or something, or just comment some random thing. And then you can also follow my Instagram, and if that pop up, um, and then you just DM me, and then I'll randomly pick a winner after we get 25 likes, and also, um, I don't know, 25 subs. That's probably what we were shooting for. So, yeah. So, the topic I want to be talking about is bats. What kind of bats? What are the best? What are the best sweet spots? What bats shouldn't I use? Um, and what bats I have. The bat, well, my game bat right now is a Easton Mako Torque 3224 drop eight. And the only drawback about the Easton Mako Torque is the torque handle. I think that's why in 2017 with their new bat and 2016, because that's the 2015, the East Mako Torque, um, they took away the torque handle, the rotating handle. People didn't like it. I didn't like it. So all I did was tape it up. So if you have one and you don't really like it that much, just tape it back up. At least rip off the tape that's on it. Cover the spinny part in electrical tape, because that's what I use. Tape it really tight, and then re-tape it. Um, well, besides that, that's the only bad thing about the bat. Um, sweet Spot's great. It's like that big. Um, that's really good pop, like great pop on the bat. And just a lot of power, even if you like hit it right off the end or right inside, you'll still make great contact with the bat no matter where you hit it. It's just a great bat overall to use. Um, my second bat is more of like my practice. It is a Louisville Slugger. I'm pretty sure they're called Louisville Slugger Primes. It's aluminum. Let me find it. Um, they're really good. Um, it's, no, it's the Omaha Prime. Hey, okay, look. Look at that. They're really good. The, well, the, that's the BB Core version, but mine's not BB Core, clearly, since I'm playing 13U. Um, but that bat is great, too. The only reason why I don't use it is because like I I make smoother contact if you know what I mean like when you hit the ball it's just a smooth like one thing but with that like there's a even if you hit it right in the sweet spot there's still a little like vibration it's not as smooth and yeah that's it that's like the only thing those are the two bats I recommend for anybody trying to get a new bat. Plus, they're somewhat cheap. Um, second topic. Gloves. Um, Alright, just so you all know, this is my preference. So, I'm a shortstop and a pitcher. So, my glove is a... Pretty sure it's called a Rawlings Deep Ball Pocket Sandlot Edition. It's one of like the remakes, and I'm pretty sure they're discontinued now. It's a 12 and a half inch. It's really great. 
It's not too big, but it's not too small either. It's just a perfect fit. And when you get it, it already feels broken in, even when you don't break it out. Because I'm pretty sure it's also pre-oiled when you get the glove. And it's really easy to break in. It only took me five, six practices to break in the glove like completely where it's just like a perfect feeling it's easy to close so yeah it's not it's like the original leather not like the plasticky shiny leather that you find on like Mizuno or all-star gloves not like trashing them or anything but that stuff's a little harder to break in I like Rawlings just a lot better just overall Rawlings is the best in my opinion so you don't have to explode the comments saying no they're not that good or anything that's just my opinion so I mean this is what the YouTube channel is for I'm talking about my opinion I'm just trying to get my opinion across to see if anybody is or like they have any questions or need any help or anything so that's why my DM is always open on my Instagram so you can ask me any question I'll probably do a Q&A soon so probably do a hundred sub Q&A so explode my DMs so that's it well thanks for watching guys stay tuned and do not forget to subscribe to this channel like this video and comment on this video and then DM me and say like me or something and then I'll pick a winner once we hit 25 subs and we get 25 likes on this video. So, peace. Drop top, drop top, smoking on cooking the hot box. Cooking, fucking on your bitch, yeah, that, that, that. Cooking